Much better. Hey guys, here's the long awaited part two. After she was all clean, we give her a spray down with some fly spray uh, and then we take and put her in front of the fan and she was quite excited about this. This is just a little time lapse of her being a little impatient three year old, um, but for the most part, she was a pretty good girl. Then she gets a cookie for being so good and then we move on to the hoof dressing. All four feet get dressed in this. This just conditions the feet and makes them look better. Um, and then she continues drying. We braided her tail and her mane. Uh, and look how white she is. Here's just a little different lighting of her. Um, she was a good girl and she turned out really clean. Till next time, guys. Tailbone and put it back into itself. He 
He has so much tail, I had to do that twice. After that, I start vet wrapping. You start at the base, like where the main amount of hair is, and then I work my way up. Make sure that you're doing this extremely loose on the tailbone, extremely loose. Um, and then when you get below the tailbone, then you'll make it pretty tight again. And that's the finished product of getting it braided and then put up. Thanks, guys. Till next time. It's almost time for this heifer to give birth again, so let's give her a bath. You're going to make us wait. How did you get this snarl? Some drink. Oh, is that the spot? Oh, yeah. Oh, we gotta clean the coochie. Thanks for reminding me. so clean pretty girl look at that clean mama don't roll thank you for listening